<laughs> My name is Valentina Kerman and I had this question, hate this question. And you see, I can code, I got fired from Carvart. <laughs> and now I found my new vocation. I am from Klokoki and I do think Jeff is genius. He has found this company. And also, he is very brave, I think. <laughs> oh, definitely he is. As Jeff mentioned in the previous video, uh, I studied programming at Carvart. Unfortunately, you know how it goes. Coding at Carbin is only good for gaming, and that's that's all. Gambas do not trust automatical machines, and they like to control everything on their own. But I don't follow this philosophy. Uh, by the way, this was probably the reason I was fired from the uni. Mm, I just thought uh, programming can be used for moving and controlling artificial mechanisms. Um, when I heard about ISR, I told myself this could be your chance to realize your dreams and I think, so far, I was right. How do I know? Recently, we've been talking with Jet a lot and I think we follow the same ideas. Therefore, I've decided to stay and try to do my best. Though right now, we've got literally nothing, but of course, an enthusiasm for exploring and programming. I was offered to lead programming department in the ISR that actually doesn't exist these days, but I hope we'll establish it soon. You know, we are still unsure about that squad contribution. Anyway, I suppose that talented programmers will join our team as soon as they realize the importance and value of our institute. Science on Carbon is doing a very, very poor job. Everyone wants to have fun, enjoy the life, and only a few people are really curious about something beyond Kerbin uh, or science at all. The interest of gaming studies <laughs> speaks for itself. Last year, uh, I witnessed 100 Kerbals being trampled trying to pass the entrance exams. We were talking with Jeb and we figured out that because of safety our first projectiles will be probably remoted, thus unmanned. Therefore we need to develop some control systems on the ground and after that link them with our up vehicles. Uh, this is gonna require close collaboration with the engineers, scientists, uh, that we are still lack of. Of course, we'll use my console in its language, but we must take into account specific designs and scientific goals to coat everything to be smooth, compatible and beneficial so we could progress further. If you want something more specific, you must, you must probably wait. However, I think that the libraries of simple operations and detections will be my, one of my first tasks. So far, I can reveal that we agree to name our software Kermes. Because anybody can beat Kermes in cleverness or craftiness. And we want our software to be like that. Moreover, he is told to be the legendary father of astronomy. Which really doesn't exist these days. Yeah, uh, and so... Let the Kermes be our divine guardian on our race. 